Hell no. Okay, we're going to play the Director's Disorder pilot episode. Um, the director, a psycho killer, has chosen you to play the main character in his next film. Will you play your part and survive the night, or will you be his latest victim? Developed by Just Source Studio. New game, night one. It was nice of Nana to let me stay at her place for a few days, so I can have some time alone to think. Just need to wait for things to cool down, so I can go home again. That's a loud door, man! God damn! You know what? I'm not staying in some shitty old cabin. I'm out of here. <laughs> I beat the game already, chart. Wait, you really just left? Come on, there's a whole movie in there made, man. Okay, let's... Who's this lad over here? Let's start that again, chat. Secret ending found. <laughs> it was nice of Nana to let me stay at her place for a few days. So I can have some time alone to think. I just need to wait for things to cool down. Alright, let's get jump in here. I see that light fl oh, Dude, slamming doors! Seems like a nice place. It's a letter from Grandma? <laughs> How could I ever forget? That was the summer Mom was traveling for work, so I had to stay here. The key should be in the shed then. I hope you had a safe drive from California, honey. You remember where you... You remember where you broke your wrist while you stayed with us all those years ago? I left the key behind there. Thanks for watching Ace for me. Love you. Okay, I got a lighter. Lighter achieved, go inside. All right, we'll go around the other side. Is that grandma? All right, let's go have a look. Ace is chilling. She's got a veggie garden. She's got all kinds of shit out here. What's going on in Wait, did you hear that? No, I don't think... I don't think so. Alright, we gotta go look at- WHOA! Never mind, it's just a thing. God damn, bro. Did I just get scared by a stick? Okay, it's behind the sh- So the house- Oh yeah! Mate! What is this? Ooh, cicada. All right, somebody's out here with us. The old owl. Take the key. Nobody here. Ace, what's up, bro? Ace. Hey, buddy. Ah, oh, boy. Is it good to see you? I should probably look for that chore list she mentioned. Should be on the table, I think. First it was doors. Now you get scared by sticks. <laughs> look, sticks are scary, man. Ace is content. What is this eyeball? I kind of have a little look around, but I think we'll have a look at this first. If the dog dies, I'm a cry? Yeah, you and me both. Okay. Cole, honey, make sure you finish everything on the list before you go to sleep. I know you must be tired after the drive, but you mustn't forget these chores. Ace needs to be fed. His food's on the counter in the kitchen, so you need to do this. So. So all you need to do is put something in his bowl and set it on the floor. Bring some of the firewood from the shed to the fireplace inside the house. It's been getting really cold at night and I don't want you to freeze, sweetie. 
Your mother's candle needs to be lit. I'm sure it makes her happy to see you caring for her after all this time. But So it sounds like mum's dead. But most importantly, eat. I left some of your favorite food on the table. You must be hungry, so eat up. Nana. Good old Nan. Oh, I've got to like... Right. Get this dog food over here. There you go, mate. It's fucking. How do I? That's a good spot. We'll come. We'll come back to the dog food. I don't know how to use it. Okay, we can light the candle for mum though. Nice. Ooh, what's this? Starman. Experience it April 12th in theaters. Oh, I wish he'd get rid of this thing. Wait there, let me... The bowl! Alright, we're gonna come back to that one. I think we lit the candle, right? What do we got in here? We got the Bible. Nah, this cooking can't be beat. Oh, it's the wrong bowl. I'm trying to put this guy's food in his water bowl. I'm sorry, Ace. I'm sorry, bro. My bad, fam. My bad. Ooh! Wait there. Need to check on mom's memorial behind the house. I think the candles might need to be relit. Dude, who's this smiley face guy? I will to go relight her, her candles. Dude, I don't like how these two won't light up. I miss you every day, Mom. Jen, how are you today? What's going on, horror? What game is this? We're playing the Director's Disorder pilot episode. Have I been to the bathroom yet? I'm well, how are you? I'm doing absolutely fantastic. What have you been up to lately? Where the fuck did Ace go? Oh no, bro. Whoa! What's going on here? Your dick's small. Fuck! Hang the keys. Yo, who's trying to fuck with my car? Oh sh! I just drop kicked that.
Hand the keys up and go to bed. Let's close the window. Ah. I'm coming to bed, baby. I could not sleep with the curtains open. I could not sleep with the curtain, 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 curtains, o curtain open. Stuttering Stan over here. Ace. Holy sh shocking lad. When I lay down, there was someone outside the window. Hey, chill, bro. It's 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 fine, man. Pick up the knife. Oh no! Flashlight. A knife. Oh shit, I've got a bad feeling about this. Was that a like a semi truck? What the Good dog. I think. Shit, the duffel bag. I can't leave that out in the rain. Yeah, you can. Yeah, you can. You can definitely leave that outside. Oh, we picked the knife back up. Ace, go. Go. Go out. Attack. Look at me, Ace. I'm gonna need you to go fuck up whatever's out there, alright? It's a duffel bag. Didn't I leave it here? Weird. Guess I'll check the shed next. All right, we're gonna go check the sh shed. Dude, what are these pictures? I don't know if I'm meant to be picking these up either. I'll just take this to the bedroom for now. <laughs> are we really? No. Are we really going to take it? Drop it. <laughs> Nah, fuck you, bro. Nah, 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 nah. It's my bitch. Holy hell. I should take a nice, long, hot bath before the rain is the death of me. Dude, did this candle move positions? Have a little look. It's the most unsafe windows. We turn some uh, some power on in here. What's the go? Light the candle. Why is there a candle already lit in here? The window's way too close to the bed. Rub it up, dub. I was taking a bath. Oh, we're fucking dead. Ace, fuck. Must left the door. Dude, take the take take the knife or the poker. Oh.
find Ace outside. Again. A knife. Oh shit, I've got a bad feeling about this. Is this guy just hanging around? Shit, the duffel bag. Can't leave that out in the rain. I don't know if we're meant to go over to that. Weird. Dude, he gave me the little stabby stab for sure. Taking your drawings. I'll just take this to the bedroom for now. All right, let's run back. Drop it. You drop it, you dog. All right, speed running. I should take a nice long hop bath before the rain is the death of me. Hello? Is this thing on? There we go. There we go. Ace! Fuck! What's left the door? I don't know, like, is he just chasing us outside now? Okay, so we weren't meant to go over there yet. Little shit. You got me worried. Don't go running off like that. Come on, buddy. I found him. Light the candle for mom again. Grab this, and then we're gonna head back. I swear I just saw someone walk past. I'm checking everywhere. I'm doing that. I'm waiting to see if there's someone outside that window. 12.07 a.m. All right, we're waking up. Get the flashlight on. Turn put the candles on. Dog's going again. <gasps> Package. Why? Hold that. Wind's picking up. I should move Nas' wash bins to the shed. Move Grandma's wash bins into the shed. Oh man. Okay, I'm guessing these are the wash bins in the back. I'm gonna drop that there. Pick this one up. I'll we'll put that there. It's the last one over here. Whoa! It's just thunder, lightning. Jesus Christ. Woo, woo. <laughs> yeah. 
Who gives a shit about the wash bins in this weather, right? Nothing wrong with that. <laughs> Lightner, lightning, thunder, very, very. Hello? Yeah. Can't let the metal buckets get wet in the rain. Something's gonna happen on this third one. You know how it goes, chat. Oh, I got thrown. I thought they I thought it'd been taken. Investigate the package. <laughs> I don't want to go back here. Three, two, one, go. Whoa! Huh. Was this open before? Yo, yo, what the? Hello? Hello? Anyone there? Hello, Cole. How was the drive here? I hope it wasn't too uncomfortable for you. It has been a few years since you visited your old family home, hasn't it? Who's this guy? Who is this? The director of your next film, Cole. I've got a role for you to fill, and I know you're hankering for some work. Okay. I'm not desperate enough to work with someone pulling some shady shit like this. If you want to work together, drop the Psycho Stalker Act and contact my agent. Goodbye. I wouldn't be so fast to turn me down, Cole. Hear me out at least. <laughs> no. Now leave me the hell alone, or I'm gonna call the police. It's not a good idea. It's not a good idea. Let's be honest right now. Police aren't gonna help you out here. Is this really safe? Go to bed! Behind my head right now, chat, that it says the next objective is go to bed. Okay, dude. Sure. Seems like a fantastic idea. One oh two AM. This guy's on a bad sleep schedule. Maybe you should take a nap. <laughs> Ace. They're the smiley faces though. Dog's gone again. Where's Ace? Why do I turn my head in real life like I think I'm going to be able to see around the corner? Stop. Straight. Ahead. Oh, Ace is gone again. Wait. Ooh. Where's my keys? What oh, shit. Didn't I put them in the holder? I think we did. Ooh, chandelier. I'm gonna check the bathroom just in case. I'm gonna light this candle for our Lord and Savior. Shut the window. Find Ace again. Ace? Dog took the keys and drove off. <laughs> it's fucking sh. It's our uh, Scooby. Ruh roh. I've made that joke two days in a row. I need to stop myself. What the hell did you do with my dog? Now, now, don't get saucy. Little Ace isn't dead yet. Where is he? I've got him right here with me. And if you want to see him again, you'll play along. Now, I was generous enough to do this out of the kindness of my heart. But it looks like you need some extra motivation. 
follow my instructions, and you'll get Widow Ace back. You say Widow or Little? <laughs> what do you need me to do? That's more like it, Cole. You're going to help me gather footage for a film. Something that'll really blow the socks off our viewers. How about we start off with something simple to Blowing? ease into it, huh? For this scene, I'd like for you to go behind your house and pick up the present I left for you. With it, you're going to vandalize your mother's favorite tree. I know the relationship with your mother wasn't the greatest while she was alive, so why not take this chance to blow off some steam and show off your true feelings? Fine. Just don't hurt Ace, please. <laughs> why? Only the dog matters. Fuck mom's grave, you know? Oh, and obviously don't try to contact the police. You wouldn't want to see me upset, would you? Now, let's get to work, shall we? I can do that, bro. Fuck mom. She was a bitch in real life. It is what it is, you know? Ace is my boy. Let's go save Ace. Fuck that. What we got here? Ooh! We actually have a choice here. Look, I think we do everything to save the dog, personally. Personally, I think, you know, mum's already clocked out. R.I.P. Mom, but the dog's still here, you know. I'm so sorry, Mom. <laughs> it's just what was that? It. Ah. Done. Now give me back my dog. Give me back Ace, baby. Whoa, whoa, don't be so hasty. I haven't gathered nearly enough footage for the film yet. We still have work to do. That we wasn't doing? the deal. Now where's Ace? Quiet. If you don't shut up and do as you're told, the dog will die and you will join it soon after. Don't kill the dog, dude, I swear to God. What's next? That's the spirit. Now, I want you to grab that duffel bag you brought home with you. I know what's in the duffel bag, Cole. All the money you stole from your charity, and you thought to bring it here with you? Not smart, Cole. <laughs> Not smart at all. He caught me, scumbag. What the hell was I supposed to do with it? As long as I could take it to the bank. Cool. Listen, I'm not here to question your life choices. That's for your fans and the police. What you're going to do is get rid of the evidence. Earn every last dollar in that bag. I don't know. See, now we're pushing the limits, okay? Mom's tree was an okay, you know? Tree will surely outgrow this later. <laughs> but the money kind of, yeah. Cash money, baby. I never knew there was money in the bag. Is the char is it? Ch it's charity money though. That's true. Keep the, the dog. Keep the dog. I'll buy the. <laughs> I got the money. We get two aces, baby. I'm not. I don't think I could burn it. I'm gonna close the door though, just in case. Let's light this candle. Pull one out for the homies. Oh, technically not my money. That is true. Oh, okay. Can we get some ones or twos in chat? One, if we should burn the money. Two, if we should not burn the money. Remember, Ace might die if we don't burn it. Ace and Ace squared. Burn the goddamn money leg for the laugh. Don't burn it. 69. Your top pack. Two. That's a three ones, two twos. All right, I'll burn the money. 
I'll burn the money. I support chaos in games. So do I. So do I. <laughs> Alright, we'll burn it though. We'll burn it. All that work down the fucking drain. That hurt! I burned it all. I don't know how this is going to help me though. It won't, Nimrod. But it does make for good footage. You'll be viewed as this compassionate, regretful man seeking to make a We didn't have to burn it! it. Oh! I don't know. I don't really know. I'm not people. It's better not end up with me in a prison cell. All right, Cole. Next scene. Do you remember when you were filming your last movie? Your stunt double had an accident on set because you were too hungover to act. Now, I would have liked to have had you recreate that accident, but we don't have time or resources for it. So instead, I'm going to have you take a knife and cut off your own finger. Simple enough, right? N n n n look, now I could have used the money to get a new finger. All right, fuck the dog, keep your finger. <laughs> That's a hard one, you know? I'm, I was about to say something really shitty there, but I won't. If it's a t if it's just a tip, that's not bad. But like... What? No! That actually was his fault, not mine. He was supposed to be a fucking professional. I'm Cole Westwood. I'm too hungover to do my job. You want to see your dog again, Cole? Do the scene. If not, well then who's to say what'll happen next? Well, listen to me. Listen to me here, Chad. It's going to sound really fucked up, okay? So, okay, listen to me, right? A dog lives for maybe like 14, maybe like 14 years, like 12 to 15 years on average. I'm going to live roughly like 70, you know, like like 60 to maybe like 80, 90 years. That's a long time without a finger. Really, I could have like four aces in that time, you know? So we'll just get ace two, I think. Uh, so it back on. Yeah, I'm a, not a surgeon. Okay, chat. Actually, one of the one of my lovely mods. Can we get a poll? Everyone says cut off a finger. Oh man. Okay, you guys are great. All right, looks like the poll picked. We're gonna cut off a finger. Fuck. Oh fuck. Oh, uh, 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 fuck, fuck, oh, gosh. Is he coming or is he cutting? I don't really know. It's done, you fucking psychopath. Holy shit. <laughs> Holy shit, Cole, you crazy motherfucker. deserve this apparently you stole money from a charity <laughs> like <laughs> you're already a bit of a piece of shit i right? left you a present in the back of your truck bring it in and set it up would you <sighs> what's he want this time okay at least the rain's died down a little bit i guess this is a good game for a freebie? Yeah, this game was absolutely free. Bring in the package and set it up inside. Where are the cameras?
A little bit of casting, a little bit of casting action. What are you? A little bit of a, you know? There, it's all ready. Good. Now here's the fun part. You're going to sit in front of that camera and confess all of the horrible things you've done. That's good. I thought it was going to make me furiously masturbate. I haven't done anything wrong. Damn it. Shut up. Sit down. Confess or be punished. I'm not hearing any confessing. Fine. Fuck. Here we go. Confess. Confess your first sin. Uh. Let's see. I hadn't visited my mom in years. Before she died, I mean. She kept inviting me up for Thanksgiving or Christmas, but there's always something else. I wonder why she didn't just come and visit me. This is getting sad, man. I mean, why should I have to be the one who has to drive six and a half hours upstate just to see her? I had more important things to do. Things that were actually worth my time. She should have tried harder, not me. I... Stole money for my charity. Tens of thousands of dollars. The money was supposed to go to those kids, and I just took it from them. We stole money from children? <laughs> and we just burned it all. They can't even get that back. But I needed it more. I did. The bank was going to repossess my cars. I, I couldn't let that happen. Acting doesn't pay what it used to. And yeah, I cheated on her. My wife. Ever since our son was born, she's just been horrible. Inside and out. Always needing things and bitching about this or that. So when her sister came on to me, huh, could you blame me? I was just trading him for the younger model. That's all. She'll get over it. She always does. He <laughs> just... Uh... Yeah. Yeah, I happened to be drunk on set that day. So what? Is it my fault that dumbass had to take my place for the stunt? My fault he didn't stand on the right fucking spot and lost his arm? <laughs> we, only we only lost a finger. He should have been more careful. Some professional he was. He didn't deserve that payout the company gave him for his troubles either. Hell, if anything, it should have gone on me for making us waste a day of filming. There. Done. Happy now? You're not done yet. Cool. What did you think this was? I don't think that was confessing. That was just proving that you're a dickhead. <laughs> what? That's it. All of my confessions. There's nothing else to say. Don't lie to me, Cole. I know, I know what happened on that road. Had a few too many drinks, did you? Thought even with all those martinis, I could still drive home. You really thought you'd be fine? <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Hold up. Wait a minute. So far, we cheated on our wife with our wife's sister. We stole tens, tens of thousands of dollars from children. <laughs> we never came to visit our mother because we thought she didn't love us enough that she would never come to see us even though she was elderly. And we got drunk on set and then our stunt double lost their arm because of our stupidity. <laughs> this guy's awesome. You couldn't. That's impossible. There was no one else there. Confess your fifth sin. I swear to God, if we kill Bambi on the road, <laughs> it's going to be too much. I... I killed a man. Dad, keep going. I was on my way home from a party. I'd been drinking all night. And he just... He came out of nowhere. I stopped and checked on him, but he, he wasn't breathing. So I... I got back in my car and I left. I didn't want to leave him. I swear. 
I, but I couldn't help him. He was in pieces, scattered across the fucking road. So I went home. And, and the next day, I called my Nana, and I asked if I could stay at her place for a while. And so, you came here to hide from the world. That just happened, then. Everything you've done. You're a coward, Cole. Through and through. Here's something you can't understand. How I could just kill a man. <laughs> Shut up. Wait, can I confess more? As much as I've enjoyed our time together today, Cole, all good things must come to an end. So I'm really conflicted now because I am the character, but I kind of want me to unalive. <laughs> you know? So this is it? After all this, I'll finally be free? So let me go? Of course. Simply finish the last scene and I'll be out of your hair for good. I promise. All right, let's get this over with. Always with the rush, Cole. Slow down. Smell the roses, eh? Grandpa! <laughs> Just tell me what it is you want, so I can be done with you and with all of this. Fine, jeez. Don't get your panties in a twist. Last scene is a simple, easy one. Burn down your grandmother's cabin. <laughs> That's savage. What? Come on, Cole. Don't play dumb. I know you heard me. You're going to burn down your Nana's house, burn it to the ground, and walk away from the life you knew. Why? She doesn't deserve to be homeless. Leave her out of this. Cole, Cole, Cole. You lied. Cheated. Stolen. And even killed. Thought it wouldn't come back to bite you? What makes you so special? I'm an actor. <laughs> Cause I'm Starman. That was me, not her. Punish me. Nah, you're going to get what's coming to you one way or another, but I don't think that's enough. This bad energy you got going on, it's gotta go somewhere, you know? Burn it down, Cole. Haven't you walked away from it? Burn the house down with firewood. Don't burn the house. Let's see what happens. Fuck this! Fuck your movie, and fuck you. I'm out of here. Damn it! Cole, I was going to make the perfect finale. I've got enough film to make do, but you really dropped the ball on... Shut up. I'm done with this. Do whatever the hell you want to me, but I'm done. Finish your fucking movie on your own. <clears throat> I swear to God, if Ace gets shot right now, I'm gonna be fucking pretty mad. Ace, <laughs> I knew you'd be okay. Oh, come on, buddy. Shit myself. Huh. Can do, Cole. Can do. Susan! An elderly woman was stabbed to death upon re returning to her home days later. Police sought to bring her grandson, Cole Westwood, in for questioning regarding the murder for a hit and run in California this week. The week before, their search turned up nothing. However, in the um, however, the disgraced actor was never found. Rumors say the Cole managed to escape the country and is now living in some foreign land, never to return to his house. I can't read that quick. There you have it. Grandma was dead, but we got Ace. We got Ace Chad and we went off to some far distant foreign land. One finger left, no money.
Well, Grandma's dead. How'd you guys enjoy that one? That one was pretty good. I'm not going to lie. If you guys want to check that, that, that out, that's the Director's Disorder pilot episode on Steam, and it's completely free 99. I'm paying free 99, baby.